to me. And nobody can tell me why, my friends, because they are keeping all of us in the dark. All I know is that this so-called king, Claudius, had my father very quickly and without ceremony to prevent everyone here from finding out. Now. Oh. <gasps> what bloody deed is this? A bloody deed almost as bad, good mother, as kill a king and marry with his brother. What are you talking about? Look! Hamlet, you have killed me. Uh, Ophelia, Leia. I've seen the most horrible, horrible thing. What is it, my love? Speak free. We are among friends here, are we not? Yes. What is it? Is it Hamlet again? Well, what's he done now? He's mad. Really mad. Like an angry sea. Just before here in your chamber, behind that tapestry, he hears a sound. Drawing his dagger, he shouts a rat. A rat, and he... Well, he stabbed Gorgolonius to death. No. No. My God. No, that could have been me. We, we can't allow him to go free. He's a threat to all of us. But that's not all, husband. Poor Ophelia, she, she's been driven mad by the cruel death of her father. And I fear, I fear Laertes is on his way to seek revenge. Fear not, my love, fear not, fear not. Guards to the king's chamber, make we weapons. Guard the doors and make sure no person leaves this room, all right? <laughs> you vile king, give me my father! <laughs> God protects the king, and treachery cannot hurt him. Why are you so rebellious, Laertes? What makes you so angry? Speak, man. Where is my father? He's dead. He's but not by him, not by him! Well, then who killed him? Tell me the truth. I'll not be made a fool of. Come what may, the only purpose I have left here on this earth is to avenge my father's death. Gertrude, give us the room alone. No, no, this is man's business, not for your delicate ears. As you wish, my lord. I fear the shadows will come upon us, and the end is dark indeed. In your eagerness to know the truth about your father's death, would you destroy all of his friends and enemies alike? No! Just his enemies, his friends. His friends here I shall embrace. Why, now you're talking like a good son and a true gentleman. I shall prove to you, clear as daylight, that I am innocent of your father's death, and I truly grieve for him. Put down that sword, Laertes, and draw near. Well then tell me, what led to my father's death? A sad story. He was torn apart in such a bestial manner that your precious sister Ophelia could not bear the horror of it. She runs distracted through the castle so sorrowful that we fear for her sanity. What made her life? That the man she loved and was so devoted to could with such cruelty Repay that love by crushing her heart and committing this bloody deed. What? No. No, the only man she ever loved was Prince Hamlet. Why, now you understand why this situation, being so delicate, had to be kept secret from all of these common people for their own good. The future king of Denmark is the murderous madman. I swear by my sword, that I will enact immediate vengeance upon this most unnatural villain. I understand that I think I do with it. We must be patient now, there has been enough hasty action. However, I, I do have a plan. Do you recognize this? Yes, I do. That's poison you asked me to bring back from Paris. Yes, it's the very poison indeed. Now I shall arrange a duel between you and Hamlet, and you will have your revenge. All I require is your sword. Good. Meet 
lead me in the great hall in the, in the they're so great. Meanwhile, um, does anyone in here have any experience with the poisoning of a sword? Oh, he does? No, no. Are we agreed? If you ever, I mean, in case you want to see some of the finest swordsmanship we have to offer, now is actually the time to go up the door, up the stairs, into the great hall. Go on, I'll join you later. I like to make an entrance. <laughs> This sword is too heavy. Is there not another? Yes, of course. Uh, here. Use mine. Thank you, Your Majesty. Yes. This one shall do the trick. This one suits me well. Why would the fuss you're making, Mantis? Yes, stop making such a fuss, Mayor. Now, we shall all keep score of how many hits the lads inflict. And I raise my cup. The toes is Prince Hal.
my best. Come again. I'm God. I'm God. So you pick up a few rooms in Paris? Do you mock me, sir? No, a swab on my head. I do not.
can no more. The king have not you. The king is to blame. So, uncle, the tip of the soul is poisoned. Better do thy work. Silence. 